Have you ever wondered how cyanide kills you? Because it's actually really insane and oddly relevant for tens of millions of people. So every cell in your body has mitochondria, which are little power plants that make about 95% of your energy through something called the electron transport chain. Here's how it works. So think of this balloon being passed through a series of protein complexes. Complex one is gonna blow air in. Complex two passes the balloon along. Complex three, we're gonna add even more air. Complex four adds the final puff, and then all of that pressure releases into this pinwheel that spins, and that generates ATP, your body's energy. Now, cyanide will actually bind to the iron center in complex four, and this is just like clamping that balloon shut. The whole system is gonna back up, the pinwheel stops, and when it stops spinning, no energy is produced. Your brain and your heart are gonna shut down first, and then five minutes later, you're dead. But here's the crazy part, because millions of people are taking medications that are damaging the same exact system. Statins, which lower cholesterol, degrade heme A and deplete CoQ10, which will slowly impair complexes one, two, three, and four. Metformin, the popular diabetes drug, impairs complex one. And then chemotherapy just flat out destroys mitochondria completely. And even if we exclude medications, things like pesticides, heavy metals, seed oils, and inflammation all attack these protein complexes. But most people have no idea that their exhaustion, brain fog, and weight gain start at the mitochondria level. So if you wanna learn more about how to protect yourself so you don't get fat, sick, or die faster, give me a follow.